sentencing in the matter of State of New Jersey versus Liam Magatazny. Mr. Magatazny is now 21 years old. Uh, again, uh, he lived in Neptune City. Everyone essentially in all the, almost all of the family members that testified came from this small community of Neptune City. They all knew each other. Um, that's what makes this really, uh, really a heinous event that these were two people meaning Sarah and Liam that knew each other since, I believe, grammar school. So I'll count one murder in the first degree. It's life imprisonment without the possibility of parole. Count two is robbery in the first degree. This sentence will run concurrently, meaning at the same time it's 20 years New Jersey State Prison. And count five, desecrating human remains is second degree. So that's 10 years consecutive to the other counts, to count one especially. <coughs> You just saw the completion of State versus Liam McAtasney in there, and as, as Judge English indicated, the case was, he was sentenced to life without the possibility of parole for the murder of Sarah Stern, among several other counts that he was convicted of. Really what this boils down to is that this just ends the, the last chapter in the book that is the notorious killer that Liam McAtasney is. He'll go down in history as Monmouth, one of Monmouth County's most heinous killers here. It's tragic that nothing can bring Sarah back from the crimes that Leah McAtasney and Preston Taylor had committed, but I hope that this gives her some kind of restful sleep, some kind of peace, to know that her killer, the person who brutally murdered her and snuffed her life out on this earth, is going to spend the rest of his life behind bars. It's been a long two and a half years for this journey. I think finally we got justice for Sarah. I love my daughter, and everybody else did too. A good kid. She was a talented artist. She was a rising star. Her life ended way too soon. I miss her. I cry for her every night. I'm just glad that finally justice is served.